Diabetes affects more than 300 million people around the world. And the Florida State University College of Medicine is doing its part to raise awareness about the issue. FSU Headlines reporter Nadia Carone joins us now from the College of Medicine with more. Nadia? Thanks, Dennis. The Florida State University College of Medicine played host to a special World Diabetes Day observation to inform the FSU and Tallahassee community about the issues of diabetes and its effects on society. All over the world, communities, universities, and organizations are having celebrations just like this and in all kinds of different ways. It's a chance to really celebrate uh, diabetes, so it's to acknowledge um, diabetes you know, for what it is um, worldwide and really get the word out and raise awareness. And today FSU is for the first time able to contribute our voice to the World Diabetes Celebration. We're very excited about that. Florida State is doing even more to help people understand how diabetes affects millions each year. FSU faculty and students have launched the PLAID Journal. PLAID stands for People Living With and Inspired by Diabetes. So many people live with diabetes and the numbers are growing every day. Um, they have questions about diabetes. Our researchers are attempting to answer some of those questions. Um, the questions beyond just the science of diabetes, but also the questions about the practicality of living with diabetes. Plaid provides a great platform for us to be able to share this research. We're really looking for research from FSU, the surrounding communities, surrounding universities, and also universities throughout Florida, the United States, and the world to contribute so that we can, they can be a part of this conversation and help us to improve the lives of people living with diabetes. During the World Diabetes Day celebration, faculty and students updated attendees about the latest research and information being generated right here at Florida State. For more information, visit med.fsu.edu. Dennis, back to you.